so it is Tuesday at around 10. I just finished doing a bunch of schoolwork, a bunch of other stuff, and then now my video's rendering, so then I gotta watch that over, upload it. Yes, I ended up finishing Fangirl today. I gave it two stars. I'll link my Goodreads review down below. I had a lot of problems with it, and I know it's a very unpopular opinion, but what can I do about it? Like, I didn't like it, so yeah. <laughs> Hey guys, so it is Wednesday. I never know the date, but it's on the screen probably. Hi. All of you guys said you wanted longer vlogs. I was like, oh, okay, I can do that. I can do that. <laughs> okay, I was just surprised. I was like, oh cool, people kind of like me. Okay, <laughs> another note, I haven't read anything today, um, but I went out a little bit. I got, I went out to eat. Gotta love bomb vegan food always. But I went to Indigo and my dad bought me a few things. What an absolute sweetheart. So I'll show you what I got. So I ended up getting their like stationary little knickknacks and stuff were like buy two, get the third free. And I'm like, okay. And kind of a spoiler for my bullet journal video for February, but I'm doing Christ a theme for crystals and like I don't know, kind of like galaxy crystals, horoscopes, like the whole shebang. Like I wanna kind of see that insight. Like I've never been into horoscopes, but I kind of wanna like see what the appeal is and kind of like look into it. But I like crystals. So then they have this new crystal collection at Indigo and look at this, oh my gosh. And, but that's not the, 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 the sticky notes. Like I'm gonna use these in my spreads and it's gonna look beautiful. I also just got, I really don't need this, but it's a pencil case with crystals <laughs> and I got a bookmark because I actually like these string ones a lot I use them a lot so yeah and then I did get a book and you guys know I'm kind of on a ban ish I don't know if that video has gone up is that a pimple damn it okay <laughs> not the point keeping it real okay so I got a sea of strangers by Lang Leaf this is poetry and prose I've read her other stuff I liked her other stuff so my camera just ran out of storage so which is probably because i haven't deleted anything off it since i got it so i'm it has a lot of memory like dang but this is sea of strangers like i said i've liked some of her other stuff some of her stuff was just okay but i think lullabies was my favorite collection by her and i was reading some of it in the store so i did think about like i and i've been like i've been like as soon as i found out it was releasing i was anticipating it <laughs> But like it wasn't in my most anticipated because like I didn't know about it. <laughs> um, but I just think it's gonna be really good. It has really good ratings on Goodreads and it seems really promising. So I'm excited to read it. And I know it won't be on my TBR long because I'm hoping to read it very soon. So yes. so it is thursday so school was average today not really i wanted to leave <laughs> honesty people it's the best policy it is thursday and i just wanted to update you so around 1 a.m or something i stayed up and i was reading sea of strangers by long leave i ended up finishing it i really like this one i like this one a lot better than some of her other collections and i was just overall impressed with it and i really liked like it's about like her usual poetry collections are which is about love loss that sort of thing and i just really like this one because it talked a lot about the sea and the ocean and it had a lot of like symbolism with that and i just really enjoyed that about it so i gave it a 3.75 out of 5 so that's that so i've read two books this week so far and i'm just trying to look at my good reads thank you um this yeah look how satisfying this is like i can't like i'm not trying to brag about how many books i've read but like i love looking at the layout like hello Day. Okay, so hello. 
how are you? It is Friday night and I'm bringing you guys a haul <laughs> instead of reading updates. Basically the Xena signing is tomorrow and I was thinking about not going just because those things stress me out like lots of people, um, lots of people <laughs> and I don't know, I'm just nervous and there's gonna be some booktubers there that I really love and like I would like cry if I met them so I'm gonna like remain chill. Well I wouldn't actually, I don't think I would cry but like I, I would be like speechless to meet like Ariel and I think Haley from Haley and Bookland's gonna be there so like and then Sasha oh my god no <laughs> and Lindsay like I couldn't come here babes he's just looking at me so I read like literally 20 pages of Zenith which I'm not gonna make it a goal to finish it by the signing because that's not gonna happen but I read two books this week so far and then exams are next week so like I gotta get my shit together <sighs> look at his little head see if I lift him he'll like scratch my eyes out so here, come here for once. Now you're not walking in front of the camera? Just don't knock it over. No. 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 Get your... <laughs> I literally came home and fell asleep, like, in my jacket. Like, that's how you know you're tired. I literally just, like, plopped down on my bed, put on music, and just knocked out so basically if you don't know hot topic hi they have like there's this thing called hot cash with them so basically around a certain time if you spend a certain amount of money you get all these coupons that are like 15 dollars coupons so i had like like five or six of them so like i had to spend a certain amount to save a bunch of money so i did that and i've been waiting for the hot cash to be available since like mid-december so like i'm so happy so i got a bunch of stuff but i got a really good price so don't at me okay so first i'll show you guys the funkos so i got <laughs> i got this one sylvester and tweety isn't it the cutest thing you've ever seen and like they're coming out with like a bunch of the looney tunes ones and like it seems so cool no cat no 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 move your butt M move your butt move move your cute move um <laughs> so i'm super excited about that one i didn't mean to get this many funkos it's just i found so many that i liked and like i need to spend a certain amount so i'm like oh i also got rupaul what a queen honestly i am so happy like as i was tweeting my friends picture like i was sending my friends pictures of this pop and i was like oh my god and like usually when you see pops online like they're usually not available in canada yet or like they're super hard to find so like i couldn't like i wasn't gonna try to find it because like i know they're hard to find but i found it and then another one just like that i got kurt cobain so i've seen him online and i was like i'm not like awesome like i really really want that but like it's gonna be rare that i find it because usually they come out like usually they're i don't know usually when i see them it's like they're coming out in the u.s can you move your tail dude you're a pain he's literally rubbing his face on the side of my boxes like all right no okay i also got tinkerbell and this is like the diamond edition so basically i have what is it snow white and like what's her face bell and these diamond dishes diamond collection editions they're basically just like the princesses or what like the disney characters but they they're covered in like glitter i don't know she looked cute so i just got her and then i found another riverdale pop so i ended up finding cheryl cool hip so i have all of them except for betty so yeah that's cool i'm very surprised to find that and then I got these, okay? I love Pokemon. Like, I need to get another game for my DS because I've literally beat all the Pokemon games I have. You look terrified. What's wrong with you, buddy? What's wrong with you, buddy? He hates me. Okay. Um, so I got these socks. <laughs> he looks so scared. He's like, what is that? What is that? Hey, buddy. I'm such like a baby to my cat. Like, when I come home, I start yelling his name. And I'm like, Broody, hey. <laughs> and then all my other family, like, my brother's like, why don't you say hi to me? And I'm like, no, I'm going to talk to the cat instead. <laughs> but I got these, like, socks slash slippers. And they have Eevee on them. And, like, you know, they have, like, the little suction thingies at the bottom. Don't mind the cat. <laughs> what are you doing? Hi. <laughs> and 
the super fluffy i had pikachu ones as this but like i only have one like i don't know where the other one went and like these are just so comfy like i use them so often um and then i got these so these are these are like those little gloves with the fingers cut out and they have like the little <laughs> jack skellington thing on them and isn't it so nice like i love it they're from the nightmare before christmas if you didn't know i love that film so much and yeah so i got these little guys i don't know when i'm gonna wear them but probably when i don't want to wear gloves but i'm like i kind of should wear gloves so i'll just wear gloves with the thought with the fingers cut out <laughs> so then i got some pants so i got these track pants i hope they like fit okay so these are pants <laughs> and it says jughead was here on them oh my god did you guys watch the new riverdale did you watch the new riverdale who's yelling in my house um did you guys watch the new riverdale it was good like if you're gonna talk about it put like the spoiler thing in the comments but like i liked it they're taking another turn and they're like doing something that i knew was gonna happen too and i'm like oh but well everyone knew that thing was gonna happen but yeah these are the pants and they're like tight at the bottom and yes i wanted the south side serpents one but they didn't have my size so okay and then last but not least i got earbuds because i only one of my earbuds works but like i love my other earbuds like literally earbuds always break for me like always like so i invested in like a more expensive pair like a year or two ago and they're not expensive but they're like not five dollars or ten dollars they're like 40 or something um and those only one works now and i was like when you're trying to listen to audiobook and, like when you're trying to listen to music <laughs> when you're out and it only comes out of one ear i'm like no like i need both so like i'm gonna try these out i really like the pattern on them He hates it. No, don't scratch my lens. You can scratch the side. Don't scratch my lens. <laughs> he literally hates this. Oh my god. Look, look. Now he's all edgy. Rudy. Hey, buddy. What you wrong, peeps? Bye. <laughs>
so it is focus it is sunday today so an update on what happened yesterday basically i did go to the xena signing it was fun honestly if you saw me there and i look dead that's because i didn't i slept two hours the night before i didn't put on any makeup i got there at six so i was up at like five so if you came up to me or if you said hi and i looked really pissed off please don't take it to any of friends because i that's a vacuum oh, great. i looked really pissed and i truthfully i was really dizzy i thought i was gonna fall over multiple times so if you saw me at the event and i looked like done that's not anything towards any of you and i was actually really happy that like i was i felt really like i don't know it felt really good that some people recognized me and said hi and at first i was really nervous like if someone was gonna notice me <laughs> because i'm like like i don't know what to say like i've met i've never met a viewer in public that has like said they've seen my videos and that's like the first time us that we've met so <laughs> I don't know thank you guys so much if any of you guys said hi uh for those who said hi to me for i talked to a bunch of people and a bunch like i talked to a bunch of people i exchanged youtube channels with some people i got to meet ariel sasha and Lindsay, and then i also got to talk to Haley from Haley and bookland which i love her channel and her so much so it was such an honor just to speak with her and she was actually like the nicest little like nugget that i've ever seen in my life and i don't know why i was expecting them all to be like different but they're literally all how they are in their videos like ariel's like exactly how she is in her videos like kind of quirky and smart and funny and yeah they were all just like how they are in their videos when i met them and that was like really cool i don't know what i expected but yeah they were all really sweet and i loved meeting them all and yeah so i did have a good time at the signing but i was really sick after so that's the only thing it's because i didn't eat didn't sleep and i was standing for eight hours which i don't blame that on like sasha or Lindsay or anyone that like got a seat or blah 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 blah, or that i showed up so early but that's because i went to another signing before and it was crazy and so i do go extra early this time so i was there for a long time um so yeah i'm obviously not blaming that or complaining about that it's just i didn't feel well so i'm just letting you guys know that if you saw me and i looked dead that's why here that i took with some people like that i um took out the signing and Lindsay and sasha took a few like photos of everyone that was there so i'll show you guys like how big the crowd was and i'm also very claustrophobic i don't talk about it but being around so many people one i don't i have like social anxiety like actual social anxiety so people a lot of people make me really nervous or just people being around make me really anxious so that was one and then two i'm also claustrophobic so the fact that i could not even move without hitting someone like to a certain point just makes me really nervous so that wasn't good okay but yeah it was fun though like i'm not trying to say i didn't have fun you know and it was an honor to meet some people so yes give you guys a quick reading update i finished this poetry collection i actually just started it when i was standing around indigo and i'll put it on the screen i read it in like 30 to 40 minutes and i didn't like it at all basically it's a poetry collection and it has a lot of trigger warnings such as anxiety depression panic attacks self-harm rape etc so just pointing that out there and i just really didn't like it I thought some of the poems were really actually offensive. I thought the writing wasn't great at all and the format of it and like some of the poems made me really cringe a lot and I felt like it was very scattered like even though it was organized into three sections it felt very scattered and I didn't like it and then also like the font looked like something I could have done on pickmonkey.com so I was like oh so I gave it like two stars it probably deserves like a 1.5 but yeah so that wasn't good and then for zenith i actually didn't fin end up finishing it before the signing which i'm actually okay with because i did my read three books this week even though like some people don't count poetry or manga or whatever as books i do leave me alone it's reading thanks um but yeah so i am like 40 pages into zenith i'm hoping to finish it this coming week or yeah just finish it in yeah just finish it in january yeah is my goal so yeah, and then I'm also currently listening to an audiobook, so I'll actually pull it up for you guys. I'm not going to show you guys my password. That's the most awkward thing in my life. Okay, yes. My lips are so chapped, it's unbelievable. 
like i need to fix this but like chapsticks don't work also i was watching chelsea's video what an absolute queen okay not my point great oh i'm playing mel's video i love her too though but i'll watch her video later look at my background look how cute rudy is okay yes overdrive So this is it. I'm listening to The Long Walk by Stephen King on audiobook. I'm currently three hours in and I have seven hours and 40 minutes left, but I'm listening to it on two times the speed. So if I round that up to eight, I have less than four hours left to go. And it's really interesting so far. I don't know how I'm feeling about it. Kind of gruesome. Well, like not like, I don't know. It's good. I like it. It is like kind of gruesome though, which I don't mind, but it's just, I don't know. I didn't, ex I didn't even read what this was about. I just opened it on my shelves and I was like, sure. So I'm like very surprised about everything. So I'm wondering where the story's gonna go from here. So there you guys have it. I'm actually gonna be ending my vlog here just so um, I actually have a video currently going, going, being rendered, blah, blah, blah. Exporting the whole shebang. Yes. Ah. Uh. So. I'm going to be ending the vlog here. Thank you so, so much for watching. And, oh my god, the vacuum. Honestly. So, oh, if you made it to the end of this vlog, comment the coffee emoji. Because I need some coffee right now. So comment the coffee emoji. And we'll do a question of the vlog, okay? We're gonna start this, question of the vlog. I'll ask you something about my channel so I can get more feedback because I'm hoping to do something really special soon. What is your most requested video from me? Like if you could choose one video that you've been dying for me to upload, comment it down below. Yes. Also, I'm doing a Q&A, so I'll have that. I did it, like I did a discussion video and then at the beginning I said if you have any questions, so I'll link that discussion video if you haven't seen it, if you want to ask me any questions in the comments of that video. Thank you all so, so much for watching. I'll see you all very soon with a new video. Bye. The fragile, the broken,